Okay, so this is Nika Soul Palace Recipes, guys. And today I'm going to be showing you um, the recipe is basically about uh, the meat sauce. So right here, I have beef sausages. And I'm going to make a meat sauce and uh, make it like a sub. So I'll show you guys the meat sauce. Um, I'll be back in a minute to show you guys how the meat sauce really goes. Okay, guys, I'm back, and I just already went and just grounded um, the ground beef. So right now, this is about like a pound. I didn't need to make too much because I don't have that many sausages to make. So at this point, I'm going to add the seasoning. So with it being about a pound of meat, if you're going to use that much, you can go by this seasoning. And that's about a tablespoon of adobo seasoning. I'm used about the same of garlic powder. Cumin, you need cumin. You do about the same, cause I'm gonna flip the meat and do the other side also. You're gonna need some chili powder. Now I'll have exact measurement guys also. Now I'm using black pepper, but I recommend you guys to use cayenne. We just don't like it too, too um, spicy, like a little bit, but I'm gonna use black pepper. But you guys go ahead, like I said, and use, uh, use that cayenne if you have that. You can put some oregano in there. You're going to need to put some water. I'm going to start with a little bit right now. Okay. So make sure you guys be doing taste testing also to make sure it's to the flavor. But when I'm done with everything, I'll list exact measurements of what I exactly put. So that you guys, meat sauce can come out exactly the same. But you want to repeat that. So I'm going to put some more adobo. Garlic powder. Cumin. Chili powder. oregano black pepper again I don't want it too too spicy sure you have that water down in there normally when I make this um sometimes I add additional like teaspoon of like salt I'm not for sure if I'll need that or not. I'll do a taste test in a little bit. But you're just mixing it. Um, if you guys want to, you could have sauteed onion in this. I'm just not doing that part because I'm actually going to saute some onions and green bell pepper. I'm going to lay that across my sausage. So I'll, have, I'll get my onions from there. But if you're not actually going to do it that way, you could put it, put little chunks in this seasoning. Or you can do both, but for me, I'm just gonna do it that way. For me, I don't want to do it both ways because I'm already gonna have that onion. So I probably used about not even uh, one fourth cup of water. As you guys can see, it's making like a sauce type of. Like I said, just taste it to your liking. Some people like it more um, spicier than others. The whole um, idea of it is to have it really spicy, but we don't like ours really spicy. Okay, 
Okay, guys, so when this is done, I'm just going to show you guys how I put together the sandwich. Remember, give it a taste test, and I will have exact measurements. I'll be back. Okay, guys, I'm back. So this was the finished result of how the meat sauce came out. Um, I did go back in, and I added a tablespoon of seasoning salt. Um, and you can add a little bit of paprika if you want, just to get the color a little more. The chili powder does it, but I did add a tablespoon of uh, paprika too, just to get it a little darker. And um, I just sauteed some onions and peppers and put a teaspoon of minced garlic in there. That's all. So I'm basically just making my sub plate. We have a uh, sub roll, so just go ahead on and toast them into your oven. Or if you have a toaster oven like I do, it's even quicker. Um, when your onions is marbleized and your peppers are sauteed, just add those onto your beef sausage. And I'm just going to put his uh, meat sauce on top of that right now. Back it up a little bit. Now, this meat sauce is very good. It has a hint of uh, spiciness. It's not too spicy like I told you guys, but I can taste that black pepper. But like I said, the idea of people uh, doing the meat sauce, they normally have it really spicy. So just take out that black pepper and just use uh, your um, cayenne pepper. I had that, but we wouldn't even been able to eat it if we would did it that way. Then just put your... Uh, Mustard and ketchup on top of that or whatever you desire for your condiments. And that's it. I made some um, tater tots, but they're still in the oven. My son won't eat now. So this is his, uh, his plate. I'm going to take a picture of it. And thanks again for watching, guys. Again, always uh, like and subscribe. And um, I'll see you guys with another vid. Thanks.